All right, what it do with your girl? I go by Neek, and I'm back with another video. And today I want to show you guys firsthand how to use ASCAP. So what you would do is you'll log in, click on Works, and it'll take you here. You want to register work. So we're going to register a song right now. Um, and I'm going to register the song two different ways to show you exactly how you're supposed to do it. So first, you want to register your name with your role on the song. So if you did not make the beat, but you wrote the lyrics, you would be the author. If you made the beat, you're the composer. If you did both, then you are both. Uh, so for me, I didn't make the beat, so I'm the author. I will get 25% of the song. And I'm going to explain to you why it says 25 and not 50 or 100. So then you would add another writer. So obviously that would be the producer, the person who made the beat. So you add the producer to the song and you click this box right here to make sure you authorize to register it. And you will give your producer the other 25% of the song. So though this is 50, really this is 100% because the song is broken down into two parts, the writer's share and the publisher's share. 50% to the writer, 50% to the publisher. If you are the publisher and the writer, then you get both. So again, this is how I'm breaking it down. 50%, which is 25, to my producer. 50%, which is 25, to me. Now we're going to break down the publishing side. This publishing side must equal 50%. 50% is really 100% of the publishing shares. So I have my own publishing company, which is I Go By Music Publishing, through ASCAP. So that's what I'm going to register. Now, my 25% also equates to my publishing shares unless I have signed my publishing over to someone. So whatever you put here as your writer's share, nine times out of ten, you're going to put it on this side as well. Now, for some artists, they are registered with a publishing admin. I am registered with a publishing admin. This admin helps to collect my publishing worldwide. So I will add my publishing admin, which is SongTrust. So Song Trust in the role is an administrator. That's who they are. And they collect these royalties worldwide. And the collection is going to be also 25%, which is actually 50% of the song. Again, here's my producer. Now, the producer may or may not have a publishing company. So if that producer does not have a publishing company, you want to click that right there and bomb. It's back to 50%. So once you see both these sides at 50%, you know you've registered your splits correctly. Um, let's see if we can make this look wrong. So I'm going to do 50% over here. As you can see, it's negative 25. But if I do 25% right here, you can see that it says zero. So that means all the money comes to this one and then they pay out again my producer now say he has no publisher I will put no publisher here if he does have a publisher you will add the producers publishing information and keep it moving so and then obviously hit apply now what is important to know is when you're registering your songs do not submit until you have went over these things down here now this is has the work been recorded I personally like to release my music first and then register. Why? Because I just want to make sure that I have my IRSRC codes and my release date and all my sound recording information. So you put that information in right here and then you hit submit. And that's exactly how you would register a song on ASCAP. 